In this video, you'll learn how to update your Canada Helps charity profile with your logo, description, photos, videos, testimonials, suggested donation amounts, and more. Hundreds of thousands of Canadians visit Canada Helps every year to discover new causes and donate. Updating your charity profile will help potential donors to understand the work that you do and the impact that you have. Begin by logging into your Canada Helps account. Or, if you're already logged in, click Charity Admin from the drop-down menu in the top right-hand corner of your screen. Click the Profile tab, and then click the Edit Profile button. You'll end up in an area where you can edit your charity profile on Canada Helps, including your profile photos, description, suggested donation amounts, campaigns, search categories, and more. The tab we're currently on, titled Profile, is where you can update the general information that appears on your charity's profile page, such as charitable mission. Before we begin, it's worth pointing out that Canada Helps is a bilingual organization, which is why you'll see the option to enter in information in both English and French. Anything you enter into a field labeled English will appear on the English Canada Helps website, and anything you enter in a field labeled French will appear on the French Canada Helps website. The first field on the left titled Popular Name French is for your charity's operating name, the name you use to refer to your charity in your French marketing. It may be different from your registered charity name. The name you enter here will appear on the French Canada Helps website. The field below, titled Popular Name English, is for the name you use to refer to your charity in your English marketing communications. Next are the Summary English and Summary French fields. The summary is a short description about your charity that will display in search results on Canada Helps. It helps donors find you more easily when searching charities. Below that, there are fields for your charity's website if your charity has a website. If you have both an English and French website, you can fill out both fields with the website URLs. Next are the email fields. The email you enter here will display publicly on your charity profile so that people visiting your charity profile can reach out to you if needed. The first field at the top right hand side of the page is for your profile URL. It will already be filled in for you, but you can make edits if you'd like. The about text is where you can fill out information about your charity and mission. Below that, you have the option to upload a high-resolution logo for your charity if you haven't yet. You need to upload a file that's at least 200 by 100 pixels. We strongly recommend that you do upload one, but if you don't, a yellow charity ribbon will display instead. Don't forget to save your work before progressing to the next tab. The next tab is the Media Library. Your Media Library is used to upload and store images and link to videos that you would like to add to your charity profile or campaigns. First, you need to upload photos from your computer to your media library before you can include them on your charity profile page or in your campaigns. Before uploading, make sure you've named the file something easy and descriptive. This will come in handy later on. You'll notice that you can upload photos from your computer, but you can't upload videos from your computer. Instead, we ask that you include links to videos that you've already uploaded to either YouTube or Vimeo. When uploading photos, images must be at least 400 pixels by 400 pixels, but no larger than 5,000 pixels by 5,000 pixels. Supported formats include JPEGs, PNGs, and GIFs. When linking to videos in your media library, the URL that you will use is the URL of your video that you will find at the top here. Once you've uploaded files and linked videos in your media library, you can choose which ones to display on your charity profile. Select the main image that you want displayed on your charity profile. The files that appear here are those that you already uploaded to your media library in the previous tab. This is where it comes in handy to have given the files descriptive names. If you want to include the same image on the English and French Canada Help site, you can go ahead and select the same file for both. Next, select the photos and videos that you want to include in the media carousel on your charity profile. For best results, we recommend adding at least five items to your media carousel. The order field can be used if you're particular about the order that the photos and videos appear. Simply select the order you want to display your files using the order drop-down boxes. 
You can link to quotes on your charity profile. You can share press and media articles, volunteer and staff testimonials, and more. You'll do this in the Quotes tab. Simply add your quote into the Quotes box. The attributed to field is for the name of the person or source of the quote. If there is a great article published about your charity online, or if you were mentioned in a blog, etc., you could provide the website URL in the link field. Next, select whether the quote is in English or in French. If you add more than one quote, you'll have the option to determine the order that you want the quote to appear from the order drop-down box. The next tab, titled Donation Presets, is where you can suggest donation amounts for your charity profile's donation form. You can add the suggested donation amounts for both one-time donations and monthly donations. You'll also notice that you can indicate the impact of each donation. It's not required, but donors are more compelled to give when they know the tangible impact of their donations. The next tab is our Campaigns tab. This is where you can add Campaigns to Canada Helps. People who visit Canada Helps can browse charity campaigns to discover new causes to support, similar to Indiegogo or Kickstarter. People can learn more about campaigns by clicking into the campaign card and viewing more details about the campaign. When creating your campaign, you can set a fundraising goal, start and end date, and more. For more information, please see our video on how to upload a campaign. The Search Categories and Scope of Mission tab allows you to select the search categories that correspond to your charity's mission and the main geographical scope of your charity's work. Updating this information will help more donors find your charity in a search on Canada Helps. You can select up to three categories and subcategories to go with each. Once you're done updating your charity profile, you can scroll to the bottom and click Save and View to view your charity profile. It's as simple as that.